Wow, what's up everybody once again, this is Brand Man Sean and today we're going over part 3 of the mystery series and we're covering Saya. So if you've seen part 2, you already know that Prince created his power and mystery through stories that he created and interactions, but then Saya, hers is number one, props. She actually implemented mystery in many ways using this one prop. And keep in mind, there are people like Dead Mouse and just many others who haven't shown their face that don't really have this huge aura of mystery in it like Saya. So don't dismiss and just say, hey, she doesn't sort of show her face. Or she puts stuff over her face. That's the center of her mystery. It's not so. First, I gotta mention that one, this prop became a part of her mystery was the fact that she wore it consistently, that type of hair covering her face consistently throughout many environments. Only after you do it consistently can people start to associate it with you officially. Number two were mini mysteries. We talked about mini mysteries for Prince too, which is basically you have this overall aura of mystery, but you create small moments of mystery for the people that you're entertaining. Saya did this by something very unique for people who are mysterious. She entertained people through her mystery. People were always wondering, what is she going to wear next, right? She had the black and white um, version of her wig. She had the big puffy version of her wig. She had so many different versions of her wig and then she would wear hats and things like that to draw attention to her. But then she even went as far as having a paper bag on her head. She put a banana in front of her face for one of her interviews. There were so many things she kept doing that just kept you wondering what exactly she's gonna do next. She even did face paint. Making her mystery interesting is something that takes it to an entire level as far as engagement and keeping people wondering, keeping you in people's mind, which is the key because mystery is about people wanting to know more about you, whether you are around or not. And number three, symbols. So it seems like the same thing as a prop, but don't get it confused. Saya did many things to mask her face, cover herself up, but she really realized that blonde wig in particular was truly that symbol that identified her, particularly because of the bob. Knowing that she was able to create a culture and extend her image far past her as a person or as an artist by simply using a wig alone to the point that everybody felt like they could be Saya as long as they had the wig. Check out this guy in the carpool karaoke. Uh, check out Taylor Swift and so many of these other people. I guess somebody made an app just so you could put on Saya's wig. They even put Saya's wig on Dory from, uh, what's that movie? Finding Nemo. As a matter of fact, the most amazing example is this commercial right here. so powerful about this particular commercial right here is the fact that the symbol is so strong at this point. It's not a prop. Now it's a symbol, which is next level, that she doesn't have to be there at the commercial for it to be her image, for people to understand it and get it. She doesn't even have to do anything. She go wake up, answer the phone, and say, yeah, y'all can use me in a commercial. Now you have to fly to the commercial. Just give me all the money. That's crazy. But that's the power of omnipresence and being everywhere whenever you have a strong symbol or image. That's basically it for how she creates that mystery, but I have to go deeper with some other things around Saya that points things out. Here's Saya right here. Oh no, it's her face. You're not supposed to be able to see her face. The thing is, Saya actually does show her face several times currently, but she used to not actually hide her face at all. She used to perform and she had a pretty solid um, following to be in stadiums or uh, bigger venues. So that brings about the question, is it too late for you to be mysterious? No, not at all. As long as you're like Saya and your pull out game is strong, all you have to do is be disciplined, change up your game and understand that mystery is created over time. And last but not least, this little picture of, of Saya, this headline reminds me the fact that the media, when you build your image correctly and do it enough, the media will circulate and put energy behind your actual image for you. You don't have to do any work because the media knows that Saya's face has been shown before and she shows it sometimes. But you see, they're making a big deal out of the fact that her face was shown at a show. So once you actually build something up, it's easy because the media will do all the work for you. They love a good story. So you got something to look forward to. Other than that, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button.